Okay, today is 5-20-2013. And what I did here was I power washed all of this planetary gear housing down, changed the 90 weight oil in the planetary gear housing, and put two coats of paint, and naturally I greased everything, and I power washed front, back, sides, and on both sides of the machine. I also am putting never sees in all of the nuts. Before I put the nuts back on, we're going to put one layer of never sees in the nuts and one layer on all the threads. And this is the other side of the planetary housing, and the oil has been changed, and there are no oil leaks. But more importantly, I took out, took the front wheels off, and I put new rubber on the front. They are 12.58018s, and they are in fact 14 ply. Maximum load 2120, 14 ply. But more important than that, is each wheel I took a knife power washed it all down and then took a knife into the deepest reset of the inner fold and gouged out any dust dirt and grease that were in there this is tire number one and this is tire number two gouged out any dirt rust dust grease, garbage, and removed all of it and put two coats of yellow paint in the fold. Another thing that was done more recently is all of these hoses were gone over one at a time and anything with a, a burr or a ding on it was fixed either with tape, this rubber, this irrigation rubber and cloth, or just tape where it wasn't so necessary. And then I taped the hoses around the new hoses and on the old hoses as well. And these hoses have all been replaced except for the yellow one within the last year. Uh, the machine is 100% greased. I replaced this slide on the extender hoe about a year ago. And this bucket, I replaced the tooth that was missing that you may have seen I put a much more heavy-duty tooth, I call it my scratch tooth, if I want to cut asphalt, it is set above the rest so that I can either scratch concrete, rip out a tree root, or scratch asphalt to make a cutting surface, or a cutting to cut it so that I can fold it over. All right, now the next thing I'm going to do is I have the oil and filters and like I said today is May 20th 2013 this is Michael Fazio this machine is a 428B Caterpillar backhoe it is for sale it's on equipment trader and or you can contact me by googling ontimebackhoe.com ontimebackhoe.com thank you very much Remember, we live in the Keys, therefore there is Skull and Bones.